this part. The guy at the counter said, this platform one. So here I am in Morty if I miss it. It's half an hour walk from the train station. I'm very tempted to hitch a ride, but you know, I don't do that. It's not a very pleasant walk because you're walking next to the main road. is going to be the market. Let's go and try and find it. Apparently this is the mosque, but it looks close to me. My mission to find the mosque completely failed. I didn't find it. I'm moving on to stop three of this day trip. Yay! These are some of the archaeological remains of the Medinet, which is city in Arabic. Ooh, this city used to be called Qalb um, Gharb al Andalus. So it just. Uh, so it was one of the main cities when Muslims were ruling Andalusia. It's interesting, I'm not really sure what it's supposed to mean, probably when the Christians um, took it back. Um, but he looks like an Arab. now earlier in the video in the skyline of Silvis near the castle from the motorway. I'm gonna head to the castle and this is the main attraction here. I know everybody starts with the castle but I wanted it to be a little less busy so I'm gonna go and hopefully it's a bit more quiet now and let's go explore. And give me a map. She just gave me the info flyer without any maps like everyone else. Wow. Just like and this is what it feels to look different when people don't freaking give you a map. It's just so annoying. Oh. Okay, regroup, deep breath, and let's go see the castle. Castle is this red brick wall that you can see and that was the Moroccan style complex that does not is not here anymore sadly. minutes to go see everything, walk across everything. Um, I was mostly impressed with the actual um, structure of it and I wish there was like more information about you know what they found and all of that. Maybe I would have found it in the archaeology museum that is inside the castle but oh well. The lady didn't give me a map so I have no idea where it was. And now I'm headed to my last stop of this trip which is the actual archaeology museum. So if you buy a ticket um, and the castle that combines with the museum, 
It's quite small and I've only seen one thing that's Islamic so far. Basically the highlight of this museum is this well that they didn't realize it was there until they were building it. The cool thing about the exhibition is you can leave and see the wall that's attached to the museum. So after seeing everything, I'm taking a quick break with some tea and dessert. It's a pineapple dessert. I have no idea what it is. I'm just going to eat it anyway. It's sweet. It's sugar. I need it. My train is in about an hour and like 15 minutes and I'm 20 minutes away. Um, the walk to the other side after the bridge, there aren't really cafes or anything. So I'm stopping here to have my tea and then I'll head back to Lagos. Oh